Well, let's continue Phantom Hourglass. Hopefully you're enjoying the playthrough so far if you're watching later. Uh, right, so I stopped here because I want to do another gambling session. I had bad luck with this yesterday, so let's see. Today is a new day. Okay, that is a that is an excellent start. Let's see if we can keep it up. Not bad so far. No negatives. Ah, damn it. Okay, I mean, still in the green. I don't think you make as much money as this, uh, as other mini games in this one. Ooh. Ah. Okay, I mean, still, it just cancelled out the last one. Alright, that's not bad. Like, I still, I did fairly well. Just unfortunate that the last two got taken out. Okay, much better. I just needed to make up the cost of uh, repairing the ship, because I gotta do that now. Okay. Probably endeavor to get the frogs, so then I don't have to travel so much. Anyway, um, we are going here first. you the guy who was with Linebeck when he drove off the ghost ship? Word is that you're tagging along with the captain, giving him little help. Okay. It's kind of unfortunate, but oh well. Ah, <sighs> okay.
Making money. One of them was worth 150. Trifle. I do like that this doesn't seem to have an upper limit of money. Okay. Bomb chew bag. Take it. To see if they sell anything new. Oh. To that, oh, okay. Guess I gotta sell more stuff, huh? Oops. I think the rest are trifles. Yeah. A crown being a trifle? Psh, okay. Alright, hang on. Let's see what else we have we can sell. I mean, that one's fine. Like, we're not really gonna do anything else. I think I'll get the fun soon. It's not that far away. Okay. Let's go. Gotta dig up all these treasures. And then I gotta head up north, cause uh, I gotta see. Okay, hold on. 
Nice shot, buddy. The big frog spread the word about you. So I want to know what to draw on the psycho slate to fly here. Pay attention. Okay, so... Um, the slate to return here. I mean, I guess let's just draw it here. Okay, that'll do. Oh, but see, uh, it's on this map. When it's on this map, it's kind of pointless, but I guess I should just memorize it. all the way to the left, I couldn't move it. I mean, all the way to the right, not left. Gotta be careful with that. Oh, come on. I don't wanna repair this thing already. But I guess I should sooner rather than later. The repair costs are low if you do it early. These are just shit parts, typically, like, I don't know. Okay. I might kick up butt again. Just because it's good money. Is nothing.
That looks nice. Even though it's probably not part of the same match, but... We'll go back to Tropical, but it's like two set pieces. Okay, I think that does it. I don't know. Let's see. I'm not sure if that's better or worse. I wish you could see. Okay, uh, we're gonna head to the North Sea. I think, if anything, I have less stamina now. Oh, well. Okay, uh, we're headed... Right. Yeah, we're headed here. We've arrived on the island. Just gonna draw that. There's a cave here. So no, no. Okay, but we have ten of courage, so that should be enough. Oh wait, it's not this island. Which island was it? I might have the wrong island. Hang on. I thought it was this one, but it's not. I think it's the one to the north.
I hope I got this right. I just want another symbol. Okay. Inverse N for North. Continue now. Island. Which island was it then? Oh, I think I know which island it is. It's the one to the south. I may as well mow the lawn while I'm here. Okay, that is useful. That's the island I was looking for. Every time I look away to the other screen for a sec. Okay, I have enough for the heart piece now. Okay. 
I mean, I guess that's useful. Got some money out of it. So far you have located 10 power gems, with this many spirit gems. More of your spirit of power's true ability will be unleashed. Come forth, spirit of power. Using the spirit gems this boy has collected, search yourself for the true extent of your spirit power. Your soul now burns with flames. Swap spirits on the collection screen. May the divine protection of the spirits be with you everywhere you venture. Hey! Ah, so I believe you can now swap between your spirits. But can the other spirits take care of you like I do? I guess you won't know until you try. This is probably as far as we're going to get. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to hunt all the gems out. But I mean, considering we're about to go to the Temple of Ice, that seems very useful. It's just easier, instead of sailing across over there. Just gotta make a pit stop and purchase the heart. swap the parts back because it did lower my stamina. I just wish it would tell you. Stamina is now five. Okay. So it's back to what it was. Give health. <laughs> A 
poor again. I'm gonna do one more gamble on that island and then we'll go to the ice palace. Been some poor at the moment. Go! Oh. Guess. You know what? Let's just leave the salvaging, honestly. It just seems to be ship parts or treasure maps that lead to more ship parts. And, uh, because, I mean, money, it's not really, it's not really a thing you get in them. this game had that many heart pieces fleshed out so they just made them full heart containers so I don't think I need to stress as much all right gamble time I think the best thing to happen is to find the RuPaul right away. Because then... No, good. That's fine. I only lose nine. If I find another one, that's even better. The best thing to happen is to find the good ones at the end. Nice. No, I'm happy with that. Get the bad stuff out of the way right away. Profit of ten. Made a profit of a hundred and ten. Made a profit of two hundred and ten. Very good. Oh, no, I only lost 10. No, that's fine. Perfect. That was good. It's the best result I could have had for. Alright, cool. Let's get out of here. I think the meta here is to just come here when you only have 50 and then try and find the RuPaul's right away. We are heading... Although, hang on. This is probably an island. 
We'll just do a swing past and then... Let's check out the Travels ship. It's the Isle of the DS Island. Hey! Look there, that island isn't marked on our charts, Lankles. And it looks like we can dock there. Silence about. DS Island. Uh... Busy, so busy. I have no idea where I should start, brother. A special challenge called the Goron Game will be opening soon. But we're behind in our preparations. We need to hire a part-timer. Okay, I mean, yeah. This is gonna be later. By the looks of it. <laughs> Snake nest? <laughs> Okay, no, this is, this is bad. I should not explore this just yet. We'll be back later. What's with this island? It's sort of a different shape, don't you think? Now, maybe it's just me. Wanna set sail? Yeah. We'll be back here. I imagine it's gonna open up after this next dungeon. So a rock or is that going to fix itself? It should fix itself, surely. Yeah, it did. Okay. Damn it, I lost track of it because... Of these shocks. Hey, 
Hey, what's the deal with all the size? We can't dock wankles. But I haven't gotten my brilliant ideas. No, really, do you see it? Chart a course around the island and we'll obliterate it with a cannon. No, but I don't. I wanted to go visit. Alright, fine. I really didn't want to do this now, but okay. I can draw it properly. Although it's too hard to draw. We blasted all of that ice and it went sinking into the sea. Hey, I wonder what kind of bizarre creatures are waiting to welcome us. Or will they lash out at us? Either way, let's go there, Lankles. Hold on, I, I would like... I would like to see what boat this is first. find them, why not indeed? Uh -huh, how very strange. All of a sudden, I can't see a thing. The uh ho. -huh. Hmm. How terribly rude of me. I am a member of the Ho uh Ho -huh tribe. Yes, indeed. I came from a country of way away, <laughs> across the ocean looking for treasure. Certain items are treasure to the people of way away. I'll buy them from you. I'll buy them for far more than the general stores around here too. Wait, what was it? Ah, I keep skipping the first screen. 
pearl necklace. 82, yes. The other dude only gives me 50, so... I mean, what else was I going to do with them? The other dude only gives me 50, so... Kid. I was wondering what it'd be like to walk on a uh, big chunk of ice, and now I know it's real frosty. Okay. Got you! As cold as that as it was, it warms my treasure seeking heart. You guy, you came from out there, outside the ice? Hey, what's your deal? Never seen an Anauki before? You gonna stare all day, or can you talk too? What? You wanna know where the pure metals are? How should I know? You gotta take a question like that to the island chief. Me? No idea. The Yuke tribe that lives over in the ice fields to the east are crazed animals. Those beasts are so crazy, I don't even want to get into it. That crazy. Nobody thought the trouble between the Anauki and the Yuke was a good thing. So we Anauki and those hairy Yuke got together a hundred years ago and entered a little peace agreement. Peace? It's a peace treaty, you know. Peace? Peace is like... I think it's like a piece of cake. <laughs> but the crab boil. Those yuke. They're hairy crazed weirdos, I tell ya. Are they just gonna say the, the opposite? You guys, did you hear the big news? One of those hairy yukes has sneaked over here. Huh? What do you mean? I heard. What? You know? Hey, maybe you're the hairy yuke dressed up like one of us. No. I knew it. I heard. You got me. What? You're a yuke? Uh, really? You serious? Ah! <laughs> this is so stupid. In a good way. It's funny. Okay. I love the way they waddle. Ah, the pure metal? The Azarine? What are you doing asking me for about something important like that for? Hey guy, what are you doing walking in here like you own the place? These villages are so weird. <laughs> what do you want? Not that I have anything. Don't go opening people's drawers like they're yours. Not that I have 
Jaws are, if anything. I'm doing this just in case this is like the Goron village. What do you want? Not that I have anything. Okay. You look bored, little man. What do you want? Not that I have anything. Huh. Three of them saying the same thing, I wonder. Not that I have anything. Draw a line between here and the island chief's house. Someone buried something in the middle. But who knows if it's still there. Okay. Also, there's a post here. Um, is the island- I'm guessing the island chief's house is here. So it'd mean that it's like roughly there. Okay. Look around here. I mean, this is already giving me money, so... Oops. I am gonna keep doing this. I just want to see if this is the island chief's house or not. Should be. Island chief's house, so halfway. I mean, possibly there as well. I don't know, we'll see. I'll figure it out. You guy, I'm the island chief of the Anuki. You got a name, green guy? What'd you say? Lankel Zabu? So Lankel Zabu. My tribe's been having this trouble lately. I thought maybe you could take care of it. Hold on. Was that you say? You say your name's actually Lankels? You sure about that guy? Alright, alright. Whatever you say. Anyway, you want to know about the Azurian, right? I scratch your fur, you scratch mine? I guess. Well, this might get a bit long, so make yourself real comfortable. We, Anuki, have got one enemy on this island. They're the Yuk. There was a lot of bad blood between our ancestors. So a hundred years ago, we made an agreement. The Anuki lived in the west, and those hairy Yuk <laughs> live over in the east on the great ice field. That was the deal, but now some tricky Yuk has snuck over here. And he's taken one of my villagers. Now he's pretending to be living and living with us, all comfortable like. So, oh, and now we come to the part where I need something from you. Find a Yuku who's impersonating a villager and kick him out. Do you get all that? Do I have to repeat myself? Got it. Yeah, all right. Go to the Anuki estate up north, Blankles. When you get there, figure out who actually is the Yuke. Yukes are liars, every one of them. This one will lie to us, so don't be gullible. Maybe if you find him, I might tell you where the Azarine is. Just saying. <laughs> this is one of these classic riddles with like, someone's telling the truth and someone's lying, and how do you figure out the liar? I got this weird feeling he's not telling us the truth. But we're here for pure metals, so let's just be careful. What if that's the plot twist? What if the chief is... I mean, the chief is the only one that looks different. Oh, 
pra cá. It said draw a line, so hang on. I'm trying to figure out where the halfway point would be, roughly. I mean, it's possible the halfway point's just here. Either way, this is pretty valuable to do. Oh, there we go. Damn. Just in front of the sign would have been better. But okay. Alright, let's figure out the imposter. Kumu. Durbo. Let's just see if there's clues in the signs. Gumu. Aru. Mazo. You can't read it from here. That's a weird name. Fofo. I'm in turbo. I hear things. I know people. And I heard you're looking for the liar. I can give you a hint, but it's not going to come cheap. No. Yeah, I almost tapped. Okay. No. I see. You're the imposter. <laughs> Take him away. They called me Mazo, don't care if you believe me, but only, yeah, only me and Dobo tell the truth. Thought I'd just say that. Mazo and Dobo, I need to write this down, alright, notepad file. Because this is, this is a lot, and I'm not going to remember it. Okay. Alright, let's see if I can get the correct answer. Okay, so... Mazo says he and Dobo tell truth. Okay. Looking at the environment as well. <laughs> Hi, I can't read it from here. I'm dad. Hello. Dad, how's it going? Okay. Yeah, my name's Fofo. You heard that, right? I'm sure you know this, but Yuke, they do nothing but lie. And Gumu never lies. So Fofo says Gumu never lies. This can either be interpreted as Gumu lies or Gumu never lies, right? If he is indeed the Yuke, it could be that Gumu lies. Or Gumo, sorry, not Gumu. Also, let's just check the names. Okay, just making sure it lines up. Kumu. And yeah, the Yuki looking for is a lie, I'm not dead about that. I'd say either Maizo or Uru. Okay, so Kumu says... Okay.
Aru. Kumu is lying. Aru says Kumu is lying. So this kind of this kind of rules at it. Okay. Cause let's say let's say Kumu is lying about Aru. Aru all Aru all Kumu is saying is that Aru is lying. So if Kumu is lying, that means Aru's telling the truth. Right? And if Aru's telling the truth, that means Aru's telling the truth about Kumu is lying, and that's where the threat ends. So then, we'd have to see Mazo. So hang on. Mazo is telling the truth. So then, Mazo says him and Dobo tell the truth. So then... Just a sec. Figure it out. This is Gumo. Gummo. My name's Gummo. Either Fofo or Aru has to be lying. Okay. Gummo says Fofo or Aru is lying. Not both. That's the thing. I guess that's the other thing, is the word or. I should probably put those in capital. And. The keywords. Never. And is. Okay. And then the last, the last hut, and then we'll try and piece it together. Dobo's house, okay. Mazo is honest, the guy never lies. Okay, that's it. So, Dobo... Says Mazo, the song of truth. Baba says Mazo is telling the truth. Okay. So now let me try and piece this together. Okay, so it says Mazo says he'll, him and Dobo tell the truth. Dobo says that Mazo is telling the truth. So if we believe Dobo, Mazo is just basically reaffirming that these two are innocent. I think the key is where there's there's uh, like a bit of so Aru says Kumu is lying, and Kumu says Aru or Mazo is lying. So if we say Aru is lying, that means Kumu is telling the truth. If Kumu says or Aru is lying, that would say that because Aru is lying, that's the truth part. That would mean Mazo is lying. So if him and Mazo tell the lie, that would mean Dobo is telling the truth, which means Dobo is lying, which means Mazo is telling the truth. <laughs> it's uh, <laughs> it's quite a conundrum. Hmm. Let me just... I'm gonna look at things visually now. See if anything sticks out as well, because that's the other thing. They all, they all seem to have very different houses, so I'm just gonna go through the houses. Okay, so that was Dobo's house. Whose house is this? This is... Kumu's house. Okay. Kumu. Okay. 
Wait, is it? Wasn't this a ruse house? Hey guy, what are you doing at me, looking at me like that? You telling me I'm a suspect? Chat, am I wrong, or is this supposed to be... I swear this was a ruse house. Did I not remember correctly? Hang on. Give me a sec. I'm just skipping back a sec. <laughs> Go to the instant replay. What does the instant replay say? Yeah, what the heck? This is Aru's house. It's you. Get back, I say. Stay back, I'm innocent. If you come at me, I swear I'll have to protect myself. Don't come any closer. Think about what you're doing. Don't be stupid. All you have to do is say you made a mistake. Book him. I told you, I'm innocent. Why, why, why? Please stop. I can't take all this intimidation. If you keep it up, I must pass out. Oh, ah, my heart. I'm getting dizzy. I'm so scared, I, I... Ah! Oh, it does bottom. I'm an idiot. Hey, guy, I mean, wrong boy. That's you, Lankles. You don't look like it. Heh. <laughs> okay. I got it wrong. So, wait, how do I fix this now? Now they're calling me wrong boy. I thought I was looking at the top hut. Or do I have to leave the screen and come back? Let's see. Nope, I might have to talk to the chief. I may have boned this one. Investigate again. Try to get it right. Okay. Alright. I mean, it should be the same thing. Okay, let's start from the top. I'm gonna pay attention. Okay. I'm gonna put a G for Gumo. This is A for Aru. This is Mazo. This is Fofo. Nice this now. Okay. This is Kumu. So I don't get fooled again. This is Dobo. Okay. We got the letters representing each of them. Alright, let's start again. What? No. Oh. No, 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 no. Fofo or Yeah, yeah, but like, I, I just wanna... Hey. Okay, this is a ruse house. Mm. 
No. Pyramid is lying. So all we're saying is, I'm pretty sure this is the clue. Because I was thinking it's either, the thread is either Aru or Fofo. Because those are the only ones that say single statements. The others, the kind, it's either an or, and then they back each other up. But I'm looking at the houses now. I mean, so far I don't see anything. Hmm. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess we can rule one of them out, so it's like a one in five, so like... Wait a minute, Kumu. No, we go with Kumu telling the truth. Because I just ruled because I got it wrong. So Kumu's telling the truth. So who said Kumu's a liar? Aru said Kumu's a liar, it's Aru. Okay, that's that's done. <laughs> because I accidentally accused Kumu. Because I thought he was in the wrong house. It's you. Okay. Book him. How'd you figure it out? Because I accidentally accused an innocent one. <laughs> I didn't figure it out. I thought I had an amazing costume. Yo, Yuk. You look so innocent. You look just like Aru. Don't do anything stupid and try to fight. Turn yourself in. Be quiet. If you yell any more with that squeaky voice, it drives me wild. Eek, it's some kind of monster. I'm gonna eat you! No, I'm not tasty. I taste awful. Eek. I'm yellow, but I don't taste anything like a delicious fruit. Well, uh, of course not. Well, I could try to make a run for it, but I guess I might as well give in now, now that I've been caught. As a show of good faith, I'll show you something good. Wait right there. Don't move. Really, Link? Ugh, ugh, ow. Hey! What's happened? That was crazy, wasn't it, Lankles? He went to all the trouble of finding the uke, and he blew us away. But if we don't do anything, he'll just get away. It's not fair. Well, let's just go talk to the island chief and tell him what happened. Yeah, I, I guess that's another way to do it, is just accuse someone, and if you get it wrong, then they're the ones telling the truth, and then you follow the thread from there. I don't think I would have gotten it otherwise. I mean, I, I figured it would be in the case of the single statement ones, but I don't know. Hey, guy, I heard the story, Lankles. What? Already? You did it. You scared the yuke right out of the village. Now the people can rest easy and sip on their savory stew in peace. But, uh, don't you feel a little mad about getting blown away like that? Don't you want to get revenge on those yuke? Well, hmm, yeah! Of course we want to get revenge. Haha, <laughs> of course. Nobody can resist a little revenge. I'm gonna open up the cave to the great ice field to the east. The Yuka over there, go get yourself all the revenge you can. That Azarine you're looking for should be in the Temple of Ice. Spiteful little things. I mean, there's the size, the size of a child. You guy, I got word from the island chief about you. You want to head through here or what? Okay.
Do not erase. The uke's weakness is really simple. The uke breathe deeply, inhale, mouth, a, throw. Throw a bomb. I didn't need to read that sign. It would have said throw a fairy. <laughs> Can, I mean, it's a it's a wisp. Can you actually make contact with the fairy? Do I have to murder them all? Just let me mock this with a P. There's another P. I mean, I think anything that's going into that mouth at high velocity would be bad. Like, you, have you ever had a bug fly into your mouth? I've seen that happen to someone and just... Choke factor instant. I guess this is worse because insides explode. Okay, we've arrived at the Temple of Ice. So this must be the Temple of Ice. There's a blizzard howling outside, but it's actually pretty warm inside. At least we'll get out of the cold in here, Lankles. What do you mean, out of the cold? It's still cold. The name. The name says it. It says ice. There would be no ice if it wasn't cold. I think I need to do a bomb chew thing. like from here. Damn it, dragon. Fine, it worked. <laughs> Just a little bit awkward, it worked. Oh no. See, if it was warm in here, this 
this floor right here wouldn't be well, for real. Am I on a different elevation here or not? Nah? Doesn't look like it. I can't stand on them, I just can't do anything yet. No! Oh! Forgot to draw. There we go. for this. Ugh, these things are annoying. Oops. Number of treasure chests, no thank you. Oh, I've already seen where it is. Pull the four levers to open your way. Okay. First left, so... L. Well, number one, I guess. Probably just mark it as number one. Number one. How do I hit the switch? I almost feel like I need to inverse it already. Oh, what? What was that? Jump. No go. That's a nice clue. Draw a line due north. Pull the lever in that location last. Okay. So two is last. Okay. Which means it's either one, four, three, two, or one, three, four, two. I'm gonna do it. One. I'm gonna guess it. Wait. I just did it wrong. That's, that was supposed to be lost. I can reset it. I can reset it. That's not gonna count. No danger here. Okay. gonna be hard to do okay I mean I could get all I could get all the clues I could but oh this hasn't really helped has it 
Okay, I need to go back and flip the switches. I need to do the same thing, but just... I even do this? I can't. It's blocked. Okay, we have to hit the switch another way. I thought I was being clever. Does this work? I don't think it does. Maybe it does. No, it just blows up instantly. Oh. How did I not see that? I don't have a key though. Ah! I slipped off. There's one more. Okay, where's this final switch? not work because it's not far enough. Okay, hang on. Yeah. 
Apparently still not. Still too far away. It has to be from here. This ice. This ice is going on. It makes it so much harder. Oh, wait, I guess I can do it from here, too. Is that easier? No. One, two, three, four. Okay, hang on. Ah. Okay. Much simpler. Wait, it helped in the room I'm in right now. What helped in the room I'm in? <laughs> I missed the message. I was too tunnel visioned on the, uh... The bomb chew thing. <laughs> I was too tunnel visioning the wrong answer. That's the downside of playing on the DS is sometimes you look at the screen for too long and then you forget. You have a chat. Feels weird to say that when I'm playing a Zelda game. There you go. Alright, come on. These things trying to be like Kirby. Grappling hook! Alright, awesome. Good, good to hear. How am I doing? I'm doing well. Just enjoying a quiet Sunday. I might even finish this today, we'll see. I can't imagine there's much to go. I remember this one being short. Hey! Oh, I can't take the face away? Okay. It's usually something with the hook shots is taking away armor. And that does work. I just did it wrong. I guess I just didn't target it. Huh? Further back, maybe? There we go. Yeah, this should be hopefully done today. The only thing about the touch combo that I don't like is you have to react very quickly sometimes.
do. It looks like there's one more item, so... It's probably the last dungeon. The next one. How many Zelda games do I have left? Uh, uh, let's see. Spirit Tracks, Skyward Sword, Link Between Worlds. Um, for, what's it called? It's like... Triforce Heroes. And then Breath of the Wild. So five after this one. Good. I mean, I'm not counting any of the Warrior games, just because they're not really story games. step process. Oh. Yeah, I haven't played the train game in Skyward Sword. Spirit Tracks is fun. But... It was a very long time ago when I played it. Skyward Sword, it's enjoyable, but if you're not used to motion controls, it can be tough. I already played Skyward Sword, though, so I'm debating if I should play it again, but do the hard mode. It just depends how much time is left, I don't know. I feel like I should dedicate more time to Breath of the Wild, because that is the longest one. It's basically April. Ah! 
April is next Saturday, and soon it's your birthday. Oh, when in April is your birthday, if you don't mind me asking. Two of my younger brothers are in, in April, so I have a few cousins that are also in April. Everyone just seemed to have babies in April in my family. I guess that's the other reason, is like, I'm gonna lose a couple of weekends here and there. I should probably hurry up. Ah! Keep stepping up here when I shouldn't. Got it. No, I heard I heard the sound. I heard the sound. That should have worked. Oh, April 1st? <laughs> First day of April. Jeez. Do you get much people making jokes about April Fools? Must suck to have like a a day where you can't trust the news and then it's your birthday on top of that. Wait, what is going on here? Why didn't that? Oh no, I've already hit it. Okay. Yes. Ah. Okay. Wait, and it needs to be further back. It needs to be further back. Extra long tongue. Yep. Wait, but I don't have the solution yet. Yeah, okay. Okay. Ah! I'm just never gonna, if I ever experience a real winter, I'm just, I'm gonna die, aren't I? I'm too sheltered when it comes to ice. Yes, I can. I don't wanna. Oh, that works. I can do that instead, anyway. You've had people who didn't believe that it was your birthday that day. <laughs> <sighs> I think that's, some, that's something I would give people the benefit of the doubt. It's one of those things that, why would someone lie about that? Just to do the whole April Fool thing? Enough. 
This seems suspicious. Okay, it's nothing. Ice! Try again. Okay. Fuck us. What, what have you got to say? There are no treasures. Just thanks. Thanks for the useful hint. Do we have snow in Australia? We do, but not really. To have snow, you have to go to um, the mountains in the east coast. And it's one of those things where the snow may be for two weeks, if that. And it's not a lot of it. So... You have to drive three hours depending on where you live. And then it's not that impressive. <laughs> but it's, it's snow. I just, I haven't experienced snow for say a prolonged amount of time. Or extreme snow or cold temperature. Like, nothing in the negative double digits. That just- that just never happens here. In the city where I live here, the coldest recorded temperature was negative 2 Celsius, and that was in the 1800s, so... Pretty sheltered. A cold day to me is like... 7 or 8 degrees Celsius. <laughs> so not cold at all. I don't want to hear it, Scandinavians. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear how you sleep outside as babies, I know. I don't have that viking blood in me. It's easy to leap farther than you ever thought possible. All you must do is use rope in new creative ways. Oh, slingshot. I forgot about this. Gavstone, this has been negative 20. You don't like it. <laughs> but, I mean, would you take that... Or would you ha rather have, say... I mean, what's the hottest temperature you, you think you could deal with? Spin! Spin! There we go. You hate the cold. But I don't know, I'd rather it because when things get really hot, there's only so much you can do to stay cool. And then you're just uncomfortable no matter what. At least with the cold, there's plenty you can do to stay warm. But I, again, I've, I just, I've never experienced extreme cold, so I don't know. Maybe... Maybe I'm not looking at this alright. Spend like five minutes in the snow and then be like, oh no, I changed my mind. Wait, what happened? Didn't I unlock this? Don't tell me it's on the timer. Oh no, it's on the timer. Why must you be on a timer? Difficulty.
difficulty from just having to do things extra fast. Oh! That's not what I was trying to do, I was trying to tap... That. No, wait, it's done, so what did I unlock? Just the door? I guess nothing else. Should have paid more attention. Okay. Suspicious. Yeah, run. You can do that. You can grapple two rocks together and destroy them. Why did that work? Well, because he, this is an enemy, that's why. But can I... Okay, that does work too. the line quick enough. Get in there. I gotta go upstairs. No, but this is where I came from. What? Okay, I've missed something. What is it? Slingshot. Doesn't reach. Okay, hang on. Ah! I thought that wasn't gonna work. I thought I was gonna hit a wall or something. Yeah, but... No. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> okay. I didn't see the eye. No! Ah! Oh! Ice. I hear from people that have snowy weather that everyone has to slip on ice. It's like it's unavoidable. I feel like I'm gonna be hospitalized when that happens to me. When you live with your mom and dad, you had negative 30, you've been outside and it was fine. Now where you live, it's colder when it's negative 20 because of the salt sea. Don't know how to explain it good. I, th I think I get what you mean. I 
I mean, if there were winds, the winds would hurt more from a place that was cold but not windy. But damn, yeah, I, I, ca I can't imagine anything under negative ten. I don't, I don't, I don't know how people function. But then again, everyone else is like, how can you survive forty degrees, forty-five degrees in summer? So I don't know. But that's once or twice a year, if that. This year there hasn't been any anything that hot. I think the hottest we got was 38 this summer, which it's not too bad. Oh, they turn around. Okay. Hmm. I can... So the moment I face them, they stop. Hang on. this creativity here? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Got it. Why did I think that was gonna work? I, I, I expect it to just be on top of the pole all of a sudden, but no. Okay. Why wouldn't the arrows cut the rope? Yeah, I know. That's why, that's what I meant when I said, wait, are we going to get creative here? Open wide. Oh, okay. Is Navi not doing the Navi thing anymore? It's just it's just a beep this time. Please tell me that's that's it now. Nope, there's still a little bit more. Water palaces and ice dungeons! The two things that just annoy me the most in games.
big boss key. Hate this palace. Ugh. That wasn't too bad. It's just slipping on ice. I just don't like it. That's all. Okay, I need to swap to like this. So you can see what's going on. This is a nice story back. Back back to a link to the past's twin headed dragon. Oh. Whoops. Okay, so I may I may have not done this correctly. I don't know why I thought like, oh yeah, that, that rope will provide a barricade. Nope, that, that's how that's going to work out for me. Okay, he's first. You. Just... Get up, Link. Okay, we're good. Who's first? Wait. Oh, the masks are off. I missed it. That's what it should have been. There we go. Control. Oh. 
I mean, those are some weird tongues. <laughs> Ah, all right. <laughs> Thanks for the GGs. <laughs> Two more minutes. Okay. Oh, yeah, it kind of lost its impact a little. But, uh, yeah, see. <laughs> That's what I was supposed to do. It looked nice when I was looking at it. I just, I guess I swapped back to this one too early. My bad. Um, thank you for the follow, kitty. Okay. Azarine, it's one metal you need to make the sacred sword. Only a sword forged of the three pure metals has the power to defeat Bellum. Hey! <laughs> I thought we were done with Navi when I swapped. Okay. You got the pure metal you were looking for. You did it, Lankles. Things got pretty wild and woolly on this island. But it was all worth it. I really don't remember if Spirit Tracks uh, has has this again. <laughs> I hope not. Okay, I think we're done here. Looks like you got your hands on that Azarine. Nice going, guy. You, guy. I am Aru. No, seriously, the real deal. So here's the story. There I was, sipping my stew, when all of a sudden a crazy yuke bagged me. Maybe it was when you exposed the yuke who was pretending to be me, but that barrier thing that was keeping me locked up dropped and I escaped. So, uh, thanks for that. Okay, hang on. There's a few things to do here, it looks like. There's something over on this side. Hang on. Oh, there's a chest here. And there's another chest here. Okay, good. I just want to make sure that I get all the stuff on high ground first. Looks like that's just... Okay, go further up. I think I can drop down and get that other one now. I think that's it.
What? Oh, you make a bridge. Okay. Doesn't look like it can go much higher up. Alright. Have I played Master Mode on Breath of the Wild? I have. I not only played Master Mode, but the way that I played it, I did not spend any of the Korok seeds or the uh, the orbs until I had all of them. So I was running around with three hearts with no armor for the majority of the playthrough. Like it wasn't until I had everything that I spent it. So that was fun. I learned how to fight Lionels without taking damage. It made it more interesting. I had to rely on food instead of clothing. I'm debating whether I want to do that again. The only reason I would, I guess, is because I didn't stream it, so there's no record of me doing it. Except for maybe the very end, because I think I did stream the very end of it, but not certainly not to start. I just know that's going to take ages. Hate Lionel and all the Korok seeds. The Lionels, they're not bad. I think the one that I had the most problems with that I couldn't figure out was uh, the one with the big club. It, I don't know. I just couldn't get that one down. But all the other ones, I... I knew how to fight it and not take damage. So we'll see. What are you gonna say? Do you know the old wayfarer who lives on Banan Island? He buried something nice in front of this hut. Wait, in front of this what? Oh, in front of his hut. Okay, I don't know why I read it as this hut. <laughs> There's no hut here. What do you mean, this hut? The Korok seeds, yeah. I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna do them again. I wonder if they're gonna do them again for Tears of the Kingdom. I don't know. I feel like no one wants to do that a second time. Money. That's gonna pay for an upgrade, I'm sure. Wait, you have you have not finished 100% Breath of the Wild? Okay. I have. I think the thing that was the hardest was the uh, the Trial of the Sword in Master Mode. That was wow. That was really difficult. Is that everything? There is a post up here, but I can't... Hang on. There's someone there, what? Why is why is there a random person there? This might not be it. Let's see. Keep your distance, guy. Yeah, um no bodo. Yeah, I got no house, and yeah, they called me no aboto. Aboto. Real clever. I got no abode. Haha. -ha. Go on. Laugh at my frozen tears. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I like being sad, but what do you care? 
You want something from me? That's why you're here? Here's a secret for you. An Uki with houses bury stuff in front of their signs with the outside their houses. We are Uki are tricky like that. What? Forget. Forget it. I'm not saying anymore. <laughs> Frozen tears. Hello, darkness, my old friend. So just bury stuff in front of a sign. Wow, this is like Money Island. Hey, I, I saved this. I saved them. I got rid of the imposter. And I brought peace to the land. <laughs> now I'm robbing them. Am I? Am I though? Okay. Chat, small intermission. Because I've been playing for a couple of hours, and I do want to keep playing. I will keep playing, in fact, but I need to stretch my legs for a couple of minutes. Uh, I'm going to get a beverage, so... And refill my water bottle. But also so the video on YouTube later doesn't become extremely long. So we will continue on to the next dungeon. Just give me a couple of minutes. You should get yourself a snack as well, or stand up, do something for like a minute. Uh, but otherwise, if you're watching this later on YouTube, this is where we say farewell, YouTube. So, thanks for tuning in, YouTubers. <laughs> Alright. <laughs>